Another feature of WhatsApp um, that can be used quite often is this menu. This is the add-on, so it's like a plug-in or like um, for the SAP. So you can um, write your own plugin to help improve the OWAPs. So this is like the, uh, it's called add-on. So add-ons here, um, they're already installed quite a bit. Uh, you can actually go to the marketplace tab and then um, find um, some other ads on that you might need. First, you might have to click for the update. And then you can find um, all these um, ads on that you can add. And you can see this is the, the release version, beta version, um, alpha version. Uh, there's a quite a bit of it. So um, there are a couple interesting like um, there are uh, open API but API it might already be here. Uh, there's open API support. So um, this one is a nice add-on where you can um, import the open API definition and it can do like the scanning for you. Um, next it could be form handler. Uh, form handler is already here. This is a good add-on uh, because it um, um, allow you to um, specify the field, the input field, and it will um, auto-fill for you. So it's very nice. And then you can, there's a couple things um, like the support for Groovy. Um, there's help in different um, languages, some part scanning too. Um, there are also scripting, meaning you can um, write a script to control some of the um, SAP um, activity. So it's pretty neat tools. Uh, so that's the, the apps on. And another thing that we are going to take a look is we're gonna, we, we are going to take a look at the, um, the alerts here. We're going to try to understand them. Actually, in this um, application, it, it actually uh, have a description of what they are. So, so what you are going to do is you're going to click at this. So this is the question mark. So when you click here, it's going to give you like a user guide. If you go to add on, um, there are something called uh, passive um, scan rule. Passive scan rule is actually here. This is the scan rules. It's the rule um, that the scanner used to detect vulnerability. Here it tells you all the rules. For example, if you want to see like cross domain configuration, Here, cross domain misconfiguration is right here. So it um, it explain what they are. CSP here. Uh, this is CSP. Uh, session ID in URL rewrite here. So you can read about um, the passive scan rule right here to um, really really understand them. In addition to understanding, you can actually configure. You can add more rules or, or remove the rules. Um, what, what we do is that we can go to this menu, the um, gear menu. This is the option. When you click at the option, you can look at the passive rule. And here, this is the, there are all the rules. So what you do is that you can change. You can change that for this CSP. Now it's medium, right? Here is medium. You can change it to something else. Like Let's say I change it to high. For example, I click OK. Um, if if I rerun, it's gonna you know change it, um, the the, um, the 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 alert. So you can you know configure a lot of things in, um, SAP. So you can change it to high to medium, and you can actually add them. There might be so what you do is that if you want to add more rules, uh, you can go to add on here. And go to marketplace and see type rule. Here there are passive um, scanner rule. You can um, install them. So what what is that? Is that this is more? It's gonna scan for insecure form form load, um, insecure form post, user control character set. Here this is the um, more things that it can scan. So you can actually 
click here and then um, install selected here it does the installation for you so you can add more rules you can come to check at the add-on and see if there's any more um, passive scanning rules uh, as you see here in addition to the passive scanning rule there's, a, there's actually active um, scanning rule as well so if you want to add them you know you can add them here let's say if I add them all you can add them all of the rule for the active scanner and the, um, the passive scanner now with more rules SAP should detect more vulnerabilities so this is um, um, the good feature that you can add more um, apps on into your application. In our next video, we're going to try to do um, um, form-based authentication.